On the 20th of July 1969, American astronauts Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin became the first humans ever to land on the moon. About six and a half hours later, Armstrong became the first person to walk on the moon. As he took his first steps, Armstrong famously said the following, That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Armstrong and Aldrin spent 21 hours 36 minutes on the moon surface. After a rest period that included 7 hours of sleep, the ascent stage engine fired at 124 hours 22 minutes. However, Buzz Aldrin has been in the news a lot recently, and this is for wanting space agencies to set up missions to the Red Planet. Not only this, but he thinks the colonization of Mars is the way forward. He recently said the following, Human nature and potentially the ultimate survival of our species demands humanity's continued outward reach into the universe. In a world of division and distraction, this mission is unifying for all Americans and for all of mankind. So what's going on with missions to the Red Planet? Mars has always been in our line of view for potential colonization. Once researchers started to study the planet, they realized that Earth and Mars have quite a lot in common. SpaceX are currently looking like the space agency that will reach the Red Planet first. Elon Musk has said that although this is doable, there is still much work that needs to be done. With that being said, deadlines and dates are already being put forward for the first manned mission to Mars, and it's thought to be launched in early 2023, and will land on Mars to begin the first steps necessary for colonization. The main issues with developing a colony on Mars is related more to the planet's size and lack of electromagnetic field. Given the fact that Mars is quite a bit smaller than the Earth, the gravity on the Red Planet is only around 38% of the Earth, which means that any human inhabitants that settle on the planets will be unable to return to the Earth due to bone and muscle loss. The lack of an electromagnetic shield also means the planet is constantly under attack of cosmic radiation that will require colonies to be placed underneath a large supply of water. This is to prevent the radiation from hitting the inhabitants. Mission plans, however, are still going forward, and it looks like humans could be walking on the planet within the next few years. So what do you guys make of this? And do you think we should be going to Mars? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.